Hey everyone, it's Brad Ross from MakeMagicMoney.com and I'm here with Ken Scott. Kenny Scott. Welcome to my hometown. We are in Noonan, Georgia and we're going into the Kroger's. Why are we going to the Kroger's, Kenny Scott? Getting lemons for my uh, show tonight, Lemon Game. For the Lemon Game. This is, uh, we're doing a show, well, we're not doing a show. Starbucks. Oh man, I just had a Starbucks a little bit ago. Maybe I might need to get another one. Starbucks right in the Kroger's. It smells like Christmas in here, doesn't it? Smells like rotten eggs. It's been <laughs> I'm so, he's here all week. He's here all. I am all he, here. he really, really is. Here. He really is here all week. So uh, Kenny's doing a show over at the uh, Baptist Church and well, Christmas party tonight. Their Christmas party, and uh, we're gonna go back to his house. He, you should see Ken's house. All the decorations yeah. he's got. It's the Griswolds. This guy. This the is Griswolds. this is Clark, Clark W. Griswold that's right me. over here. The Griswolds. You need any bananas for uh, Vanishing Bandana? No, that's for the kids' show tonight. That's adult for the show. kids' tonight. Ooh, we get to see Ken Scott's versatility. There you go. There you go. His versatility as a, the average age is seventy. The average age is seventy. So this is pretty good. Uh, you might want to puree those uh, lemons over there. So Ken, how do you pick out a good lemon for the lemon game? All right, good lemon. This is decent. It has to be an Audi. It's an Audi. You don't really want an Audi for lemon game or any kind of lemon Now why is that? It's just, uh, well, we don't want to give secrets away, but this is a pretty good one. It's pretty flat. That's pretty That's flat. That's a pretty good one there. Um, this one, no good. That's really okay. an Audi. That's too much. Hard to load. In these, but these. How about are, firm? Does firmness matter? Uh, no. I actually like them softer. They're easier to cut when they're softer. But these are pretty good. So right, we got. Uh, we just need one, but we're gonna get two just as a backup. As a backup. Why? Because. Backup is backup. Backup is backup. All right. Excellent. So now, I am I gonna need to like get a snack, some popcorn, bring my own refreshments for this show, or? No, no. They had this is at, at a Baptist church. And, uh, but that, that's not like a Jewish function where there's always coffee and cake. You know, that's how I be, usually. There'll be plenty of food. There's always plenty of food. You know, the saying is. But you know, I, if someone dies. You know, the joke is if someone dies in the Baptist world, they go, "We sure are here about your mom. Here's some fried chicken." <laughs> there you go. <laughs> but you know, I'm not a big fan of eating at gigs. Well, we you won't know. eat. We won't, we won't eat. eat. We won't eat. I'm taking Brad out for his birthday tonight. That's right. Oh, Kenny Scott. Like Crystal or Taco Bell. Um. We're gonna to have to reevaluate those two choices. When you hit 40, we'll go. We'll move up to maybe Long John Silver. We have All right, Long John Silver. All right. Well, we better uh, go pay for this, and uh, I think I might stop for a Starbucks. We'll see you in a sec. Ken Scott, so you uh, you're here setting up for your show? Yeah, we're set up. We're set up. How Doing long? a Christmas party night for uh, I guess it's. Senior citizens. Yep. Fun group. They're always fun to, to fun group. Have fun with. Uh, yep. They run a little late. Jimmy Jimmy Brown recommended you for Jimmy the show, Brown. Isn't it? This is very fun. Jimmy Brown. Hey, 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 hey. Jimmy, hey, give us hey, yeah. the Bring the mints. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, hopefully we'll go on in about the next uh, 40, 35 minutes, forty minutes. Hopefully we'll do a. Uh, uh, wait. So so we're we're waiting here for like another 30, yeah. 40 minutes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. It's a uh, holiday party. They're never on time. They're never on time. Never on time. And this, this is a Tuesday night. Now, this is not your typical gig, this this demographic, no. but you know. You take it. It's a Tuesday night. Tuesday night. What else you gonna do? All right. And I'm a mile down from my house. And you're a mile from your house, so you know. You can't get any better than that, right? So you know, Ken Scott will go out for 10, 15 bucks if it's a mile from his house. Hey. You know, hey. <laughs> we'll edit that part out, maybe, maybe. There you go. So give us a uh, give us a little uh, tip, a little marketing tip. Tip, marketing uh, tip. Give us some something, something right now that's going on in your business that uh, you know is working well for you. You know, in the year 2010, approaching 2011. What? Uh, give us a little tip. Well, like tonight, the tip is I want all these people to at least know my name. That's something I've, I've preached in years past on your things. I want yep. them to leave knowing Ken Scott, and it's going to be uh, 
I don't want them leaving tonight just saying the magician or some other name. I don't want them to know my name. So hopefully in tonight's show, they'll at least, if they didn't enjoy the show, they'll at least remember the show was bad by Ken Scott. So uh, that will be... Bad in a good way. Bad. You know, like like well, fat, P-H-A-T. Yeah, fat bad. Fat bad. Fat yeah. back. Fat, fat back. I can say that. I think so. so. Uh, that, but that's that hadn't changed since 15 years ago. That's what I've been doing every show. And I, I encourage everyone to do the same thing, to, to really focus on letting them remember your name. If you don't, what's the point? You know, I don't want to be just, if you're looking at the newspaper and they go, well, there was a magician. I don't, want to, I don't want to be classified as the magician. So hopefully they'll leave knowing my name. Uh, and that's uh, obviously will get you repeat bookings down the road when they can say, hey, we need Ken Scott as opposed to a magician. So. And uh, you know this, this can pay off because even though this isn't your typical demographic, you know they all have. You know, oh, they just closed the door on us. I guess they they didn't want to hear our marketing. They're tips. through with our marketing tips. They're through with our marketing tips. But this can help you in the future. You know when you're uh, trying to book other family events, kids show right. events. You know they know who Ken Scott. Probably is. more so in the family events because yeah. uh, uh, you want the kids to remember you. Yep. And so I think that that benefit that little tip I'm sharing with you it pays off bigger in the. Uh, in the the uh, kid show market, the kid show family market. market, yeah. So, because typically good. they got they got me this particular group tonight got me from a kid show. And there you go. This was a grandmother who saw me at a birthday party. So she, oh, and I, let me guess, she got one of your uh, dollar bills. Brad Ross funny money funny dollar, money bills. dollar bills. And her it. question was, it. does it spin? Uh, and you said, no, only doubles, and I folded in half. Uh, dun, 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 dun. And on that note, uh, yeah, Ken and I are going to go. Uh, we'll catch back up with you. Later. We will. Catch up with you in just a few. Say hey. Okay, Junior, ready? Take your finger on your brain and kind of dance side to side like that. <laughs> so they're, they're, come on, June. 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 They're begging you to dance for them, June. All right, I'm going to finish drawing your card here for you then. I've got the card. You know you're not dancing for it. Right? The card she picked. The black card, the ace of clubs. Is that it? <laughs> Was that cool how your ring ended up in the machine? Okay. Yeah, very cool. All right, I know what happened here. Her card is here, you just can't see it. You see, on this piece of paper is an entire box of cards. Her card is there, you just can't see it. Let me show it to me. See, I could draw a line here and a line here. You see, this becomes an entire box of cards, and your card is definitely there. It's like right there. You can see, come closer. You can, do you see your card, June? Yes. Okay, good, thank you so much. She said yes. You're like wanting to leave, don't you? No, don't leave. We have two more hours. Come back. Here, June. Watch the drawing. Is that the right card? Look, it's stuck on the paper. Hey, June, I'm going to give this to you. Let me give this to you. Let me give it really quick before you leave. Here's the best part. Here, take this home with you. It's a little souvenir from the Ken Scott Show. Rub your fingers. Make sure it's stuck on the paper. Rub your fingers on there. Is it stuck on the paper? Rub your hands in the back. Make sure it's stuck on the back, too. This is for you from Ken Scott, MD, Magic Dude. <laughs> give her a big hand. Thank you, Miss June. Now go back to your seat. Thank you, Miss June. Thank you, Miss June. Thank you, Miss June. It's your birthday. Hook em horns, how do you do that? Is that this? Hook em horns? That's Texas, brother. That's Texas. That's kind of along the same line. Though. That's it, it's the same thing. But happy birthday to you. Thank you. Enjoy, enjoy. Will do. Thanks, All right. <laughs> Thanks to Kenny Scott over here. There you go. Happy birthday, buddy. Thanks, Kenny Scott. This is my uh, this is on my uh, my bulk up plan for the winter. Ah. I don't want it to fall. I better go eat this. <laughs> eat it. It's melting away from you. It's melting Happy away. birthday. 23? 24? Yeah, I think 21. 21. 21. Yeah, right. We'll see, you. we'll see you back at Ken Scott's house. See ya. Here we are, back at Ken Scott's house. Ken's going to give us the tour of his uh, winter wonderland. All right, so this uh, completed the day. We got to see a show, and now we're back at my house. Nice dinner for Brad's birthday. Ken did a great show for the old folks. They uh, 
They were they were loving him. They were pinching his cheek. Ken got to visit with his old um, coach, his old coach from uh, Little League. Little League, right, Ken? Yes. Baseball. Yep. Baseball. He got he got his his cheeks pinched, his butt pinched, uh, and, uh, and yeah, they they loved him over there. And Kenny Scott took me for a beautiful birthday dinner, as you saw. I think you just saw the ice cream at the end. And now we're back at Ken's house. And it is cold. And I it's, mean, it's, it's Georgia. And it's freezing cold. cold. 15 degrees with about a minus it's feeling. It's freaking like cold degrees. out here. So this is Winter Wonderland. Got this Rudolph. This is the, uh, the South Wing. South Wing. If you hear the music really closely, you hear the music. There you go. trees. And then we go over to the North Wing of the place. Frosty. 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 And we've got a polar bear over here. Huge air balloon. Take a look at the air balloon. Well, that, that's the big grand finale. Oh, that's the grand finale. We've got our, our our polar bear is very cute. Ferris wheel. Ferris, a Ferris wheel. wheel. Uh, can I go for a ride? On, no. Can I go for a ride on that, Ken? Come look how it's held together. This is what's good about these things: magicians and duct tape. Duct tape. Look at that. Duct tape. It holds everything together. Amazing. Even Ferris wheels. Even Ferris wheels. Amazing. Look at this. Got some cords down here. Is this OSHA approved, Ken? No, don't show that part. Oh, gee. Oh, gee. Sorry. <laughs> I tripped on some of the cords. He doesn't give public tours usually. Have a Merry Christmas. How long has that been floating around this time? It's been, uh, it's, uh, this is a family years. tradition, right? Yeah. That's pretty nice. And we got a big, uh, hey, you got a floating, you got a floating ball over here. This ball, actually, there's some history behind this. The is old that Macy's tree. Yeah. This is actually a the ball that would go on the Mesa's tree that's outside. So this is the size of the balls that you would see on those trees outside. Like, in, in New York City? Well, they don't have ornaments on New York City, but this is the Mesa's tree in Atlanta. And you, you bought that, or what uh, happened? This is, they gave them stole a it? Boy, I stole it, yeah. You stole it. <laughs> there you go. There you go. <laughs> some history. And uh, as, we we swing, as we swing to the south wing. South wing. Santa's Village. It's right over here. This is my family. This is the family here. There's Ken. There's Ken. There's me. Ken. This is uh, my wife. His lovely wife, Mrs. Ken. This is uh, my daughter. Your daughter. This is my other daughter. My other daughter. This is the Red Rock, Red Riding Hood. This is my other daughter. Other daughter. And this is, well, we're not sure who she is, but she's here. <laughs> there. That I love this ornament. That's really. This is called a bad rental. <laughs> it's all they had. I rented it in Columbus, Georgia. <laughs> now, now, there is one more surprise, Ken, isn't there? Yes. There is one more. Well, look at the roof. Look at the roof. Look at the roof up here. Ken, Ken's famous for raising the roof in his fantasy magician, and he certainly did raise the roof because Snoopy's flying by up there. And one last big surprise. I can't believe it. He's even surprised. Oh, oh, oh. Santa Claus is here. He, oh, oh no, Santa. Santa? Santa? Uh, Ken, I, I, I think Santa got frozen. Oh no, he's frozen. Oh, what, what are we gonna do? Well, Ken, Ken you, better, you better bring Santa inside. Cause we'll bring him inside. We'll so bring him inside. It's been a great adventure. It has and, been a great uh, adventure here at uh, the Magical Land of Ken Scott. You get to see the house. This is Winter Wonderland. In Atlanta, Four Georgia. Days to, to decorate, and then we take it down in about is, two hours. This is quite the uh, this is quite the house. So, so. Brad's here. Uh, his performance is in Atlanta uh, Sunday. We'll go see him Sunday at the Phillips Arena in Atlanta, I'm and uh, about that. At the Disney Show. So, yep. go get warm. It is cold out here. It's cold. Happy birthday. Thanks, Kenny Scott. See, see you later, you everyone. Hey, and remember, don't forget, do what you love and love what you do.